Hello everyone and welcome back to Level Plan 2. We are making really good progress. I've only got 8 key keys to get until I can time warp again. Um, so I'm going to go, I'm going to head east. I'm going to try out the next dungeon and see how, how easy, how easy it is for me. I feel like my sets are really high. I don't use poison because it's slow. And I feel like there's no need to use a slow ability. Let's see, grind is just enough to kill that hawk at that point. Yeah, I was looking at my chronometers then. I was thinking, looks looks like it hasn't gone down at all, but it's actually gone from. Because I was thinking it looked like it's still at 998, but it's actually 988. There's the other one. <laughs> There's the other straggler. Well. Attack. Now my uh, max economics has gone from 998 to 999. It's alright. Right. Yep. You wanna go left. Left is the way. Uh I might counter it up. I wonder what this is gonna be like. Oh, this is a very close death. So I'm thinking this spell setup is probably going to be good enough for the rest of this time warp cycle. That's what I'm reckoning. Time oh Leprechaun at the front. Yeah. A bit late for that to really matter though. Standing guard, not going to help you. Actually, I'm wondering. Um, could I take on base 22? Is that, I mean, uh, see this is where it's had to get a bit questionable with these poltergeists. I 
this is where they start doing quite a bit of damage. So, probably not. Um, I'll take it once more, then I'll try death. That was good timing. I think that worked out quite, quite well, actually. So, um, I shall restore... Ah, it's not good enough. It's just not good enough. This ghost just got me. I think. Can I... Gonna restart? Oh! Oh! Probably not, come on. No. Oh, so close though. Right. Um. Tell you what. Just for the sake of it, let's collect this chronic fact and get back to a thousand. Uh. Also helps with step mine a bit. Yeah, let's just head straight back there. I think that poltergeist was a bit of a, an anomaly. I think, they're, I think they're quite rare there. right up because I do want to try to extend this this warp cycle to another dungeon if I can I'm gonna need all the stats I can get Probably didn't need to do that. Ah, poltergeist. Was at the front? I could maybe get a regenerator all on. Someone's a bit. Ah, nice. Poison. Good timing. Oh, Blake, it's, you're too close to death for my liking. I don't need to set mine just yet because I want to get some healing on. Star all. Ah, we're usually too early for that. Don't want to rage with Blake, it's too dangerous for you. Let's, yeah, let's get that down. Oh. Seven. It's a low end. Ah, could have raged. No. I like how, like the poltergeist, you don't actually see the poltergeist itself. You just see the, the sword and the shield. Oh dear. I feel like my stats are high, so... Uh... <laughs> yeah, I feel like my stats are high, so it feels strange that um, the things are killing me so much. Um... Let's let's turn up a little bit in base 15. I mean that decreases the chance of me being able to go through another base after that because I'm going to be using up some of my some of my chronometers. But I'm not having the I'm not having the winning streak. I mean I was on quite a big winning streak there. I think I've 
I've um, I was going to say like I ran it out. Oh. Not to say that that's how probability or luck works, but it's just the fact that I think I was powerful that I was able to progress so far, and because I've progressed so far, that means I was able to. That because I've progressed so far, I've jumped ahead quite a bit in enemy strength. Yeah, 15 should be around here, shouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do a bit of training in here, not too much. I think I think if you have a like a long early streak if you happen to keep going to dungeons to train up and then go to the next one your experience keeps up with the rising the rising nature of the of the um of the strength of the enemies but I think what's happened with me is because I managed to get five keys so quickly like last time um I think what's happened is that I've sort like the strength of the enemies has outpaced the leveling I've gained from going through those uh, going through those dungeons. So it, it does seem like my progress is going to really start to slow down now. Ah, it was... Oh well, it was... It was quite a bad time to use step mine, but... It didn't do much damage anyway. Getting into a lot of battles, which is good. I want to. That's why I'm here. This is a spell that I wouldn't normally use this much, but it just comes with so many enchantments. Give it nine more into health. So three six two five. Can I kill this? Three six six five. Okay, so it's gained forty from that enemy. After this fight, I'm just going to go head straight there. Do I have the boost enchantments equipped? 
Uh, not really. It's just the extra, the extra growth from the time up, I guess. Right. Well, I thought put main contract up. Yeah, I cannot see me getting. I mean, maybe if I after this, if I go to number twenty-two. I might be able to do it. I don't know. So I'm thinking for my third time up cycle, I'm going to, um, I don't know, I will definitely start off by focusing on collecting Quarifax. But these fights, unless I come up against a poltergeist, I think I'm just gonna I think I'm just going through the motions. You can see that you can see the enemies appear in that left panel before the panel's fully gone has fully gone away from the previous fight. I killed the triangle. Nice, nice combo. Very nice string of attacks. Be very nice if I can if I can complete um base twenty two. And I want to, I'm keeping my encounter rate up just on the off, well I do want to try it but I'm keeping my encounter rate up so I can get the stats for it. 
I'm gonna go for 22 rather than 18 because 18. Um. Well. I don't. I, don't, I just seen. I don't, I don't. Well, for one, it's um. For one, the the path in base 18 is quite long, whereas with 22, you just, if you know exactly where you're going, it's not that long at all. I mean, that's the big problem, figuring out where you're going. Um, it's a big thing for 22. For 18, that's not the issue at all. Anyway, someone's going to get shot. Let's kill them first. I need 2,000 with a death. I like how when you kill a monolith, it doesn't come, see the zero experience. It doesn't say plus zero experience. It just doesn't. It just doesn't have an experience pop up. Yeah, death really does help when you've got the high stats that you can just use it. And just kill them. That's fantastic. <laughs> if it's that powerful, you don't have to worry about its accuracy. Got it. See that death didn't work. But yeah, I want to do this, I'm going to go and give 22 a try. Like I said before, I always tend to forget just how far up 22 is. Right, took one extra unnecessary step. Wait, kill this and step mine. Got a Templar down a bit. No. Yeah, Blake keeps getting poison. Poison's not good for easy fights. Poison's good against the big, bulky enemies that take a long time. I mean, 12 for 15 seconds. That's like. Um, a hundred and seventy-four. So 
that right? 170, 12 times 15 is 174. No. Uh, 180. 180. Yeah, 180. So poison. Um. Oh, oh. I'm still scrolling in the menu there. Um, poison. It's overall more damage than step mine. Max chronometers, not much. Of course, the downside is that it's slower. So I think against pandemonium, poison is going to be the one of the the MVP, as it were. I don't know. How's it compared to chaos? Chaos. Half of three. 350, 175. Yeah, it's better than chaos in that context. But yeah, against pandemonium, poison, chaos, step mine, they're going to be the main. Uh, um, abilities that I'll be after, the main demonic spells I'll be after. Healing wise, Outer Essence, Regenerate All, Restore All, definitely Restore All, uh, Regenerate All, um, Restore All, one enemy, Restore All is going to be better, slightly, of course it's got the it's got the plus side of it being it's got the generate all has the downside of it being slow but in a way it's got the plus side of being slow because it means you can use it uh, when your health is still like near the top but yeah uh, outer essence 100% for 170 um, That's gonna be like so two restore alls. One enemy two hundred and I'm just thinking of here. Uh, so if restore all is two hundred and sixty power at fifty percent. Half of that is hundred and thirty power. And outer essence is hundred and seventy, so outer essence is gonna be the best spell for that. Yeah, so ideally outer essence. If not, then restore all and regenerate all. Um, but of course, it depends on what you can get with enchantments, doesn't it? So, I mean, they're the ones you've got to hunt out for, but you know, it might not work out that way. I mean, there's some that just obviously no point using, like Quake or Inner Demon, just no, just pointless. Utterly pointless. Well, again, it just depends on what you can get. Because even like heal all, for example, can be fine. I mean, it's not going to be ideal, but if it comes with a lot more enchantments, then it can work out. Of course, there's a question of how good would re would revive be. I think that one's the most questionable because if you're going to be it's one long fight, isn't it? So your characters, if you don't have revive, your characters aren't going to be reviving at all. So 
So a revive could be very valuable. But you know, I mean, I don't wanna, I don't wanna plan out too vigorously now because I'm not in that position. I mean, the thing is, is you're gonna have to train so much that you're gonna need spells. Like enhancers are gonna just having your inventory just enhance things with like attract on and um think things with attract and thing and like enhance and all that and all the the, the um, boost enchantments. Counter it down. And let's head up. I'm going to give number 22 a shot. There it is. I hope my flag... My flag thing was decent. I'll turn my card right off. Yeah, the um, oh abomination. Let's see. I think I think this will be all right, but of course you can't. You can never be too sure. But I think um, I think I should be okay. Let's kill the Sphinx. that worked out. <laughs> there was a chance that it didn't. Yeah, easy fight. Yeah, this this is a very complicated dungeon. If you if you don't know what you're doing, anyway, it's down here. Yep, there it is. Sh I should um, do that. Okay. I mean, the nearest base to here is 23, but there's no way I, you need like 700 odd chronometers to make it through 23. So it's just not happening. But yeah, it's interesting. Um, it seems to be beneficial to like skip over a few numbers. I mean, I can try and go for 18. A 
I mean, I better get out of here. Out of here first, of course. Uh, regenerate that, please. Good. Generators are coming in handy. Ah! I don't want to death it now. I'd like to heal all the. Is that mine? No, that failed. Well, Warren's got three deaths lined up. Just need to knock it down a bit. Yeah, you've got nothing to siphon from. The siphon's not going to work for you. And Yeti, go on, hit the Sphinx. Go on, Yeti. I didn't want to comply. Was it a bit early for that, do you think? I think it probably was. Yeah, I'm going to head to base 18. I mean, I think I'm not worried stat-wise. I just I don't think I'll have the steps to make it. How far away is How far away is base eighteen from this place? Mm. Yeah, I don't trust that I can make it. I will put my encounter. What I'll do is I'll, I'll I'll leave here and I'll then I'll put my encounter down. My encounter right down. Oh, come on! I might not even make it out of here. No, uh -huh. oh, I don't want to rage. <laughs> right, I might make it. I might make it. I've got a restore that's powered up now. The hydra's gone. Definitely poison. I've got two rages, but I want to sort of like save them for when it's low or lower. Ah, poison mist. <laughs> Again, <laughs> I like how poison mist, like M I S S E D, it sounds like poison mist as in M I S T. And poison mist actually makes sense as like a concept. Oh, 
Will that be enough to help? Ah, yeah. I wasn't actually paying any attention to its health at all, I was paying too much attention to my own. Oh, too much. More attention. Right. I'm gonna keep the encounter rate down now. Right. I don't think I can make it, but I'm gonna take the journey. Battles here shouldn't be too much of a problem. I mean, they're gonna be easier than 22, and I'm at higher stats. I think it's going to be close. I oh, thank you, Mech, for killing that executioner. See with this one you can see all the dead ends once you've cleared the fog. Ah I'm not sure how it's gonna go. Anyway, Yeti, who are you gonna attack? Yourself. Nice. Who are you gonna attack this time, Yeti? yourself again. <laughs> oh Yeti. I'll, 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 I'm doing you a favour by... I see you attack Warren there. You want to attack yourself, I'm doing uh, you a favour by joining in and also attacking you. Yeah, it's, that's... I'm gonna make it that way, it's just don't have enough, enough steps. Oh, I think I'll make it. Well, isn't that like, neat? So, 16, then 22, and then 18. You can just make it all in one go. That's so, so neat. I'm not even paying attention to these anymore. gonna leave him. Um Right, well So I'm gonna go for nineteen and twenty now. Don't know what's gonna be like in nineteen. Uh at these current post warp stats. Let's try it out. <laughs> yeah, so nineteen's up here. The journey in 19 isn't too long. 20 is quite long. Uh, oh, gone too far. Right, okay. Yeah, I know where I'm going. So, yeah, I don't know what these fights are going to be like. Um, with my newfound warp, post warp stats. 
the answer is, I think, it's going to be a bit of a problem. I don't know how much death he's going to do. I think, I think roughly, as a general marker, death can do, oh, yeah, it can do around half of your HP, or your max HP. That seems to be a general rule. Right, okay, well, I think I will win these down, but I think I've got it. The orc could just growl there. Oh, I like it when the healing spells hit. Got a death ready for when it falls below 1500. Got some more healings. Just need it. Poison. Do like me some poison. Um. Ah. Uh, didn't quite work out. Let's get a couple more hits. Uh, come on. There. I didn't want to leave it. I, I wanted to save it, but I didn't want to leave it too late. So yeah, every because every battle inside a dungeon has the same takes from the same set of enemies. If you win a battle, if the next battle, you have a a higher chance of success than the previous battle. It's just that there's also the random nature of whatever enemies you find. So this one probably won't be too bad. I mean, we've got the Wiseman, but a Templar and a, and a Samurai. They're alright. Actually, oh, when I, ah, yeah, when I went through 16, I, that previous warp cycle actually did a little bit of training, didn't I? That's interesting. It just, it just makes me look forward to the later time warp cycles when, like the next one where it's going to be even easier. I'm going to level up even faster. Ah, you just missed it. Time for Blake there. Get at it, mate. Double bubble, toil and trouble. I don't actually know the order of the... Like, there are... The which is abilities like in order of rarity. Sure, every enemy has like one that's forty percent, one that's thirty percent, one that's twenty, and one that's ten. And I don't actually know which is which. Oh. Yes, we didn't rate all. No rage mist. So the abomination there. Here's a question that I have. Now I made the sprite, so I kind of have like an idea. Um, but of course, looking at it now, I'm not sure. I mean, you can't see it now because I just killed it. But so it's an abomination, right? The idea being that it's some sort of like failed science experiment, and it just looks wrong. It, you know, it's like a very uncanny valley and all that. So that's why it's got. One huge arm, one tiny arm, and one huge leg, and one tiny leg. So the bottom part of the big leg is... Do you see that as its foot? Or as its, um... Like, a leg dragging along the floor? 
because I think it's meant to be its foot. I do really like this place though. Ah. Thank you, Mac, for killing that wyvern. Thank you, Mac, for killing that witch. Um When the blue bar, I mean, I don't know if I pointed this out, but I should. When when the blue bar flashes on the screen, well, one thing I was going to mention just now is that I like the way that it. I think it's interesting the way that the colours mesh with this this dark red that this particular dungeon uses. Ah, see, now I've had my encounter rate on low, haven't I? So. I wonder if that's going to be to my disadvantage in the long run. But yeah, what I was saying was, um, what I was going to say was, I probably should have mentioned this earlier, but the blue bar that flashes on the screen, that's a reference to level up land one. I should have probably mentioned that by now if I haven't already. Um, because in the first game when you fight an enemy, you've got the blue bar on the screen where it says like versus whatever enemy it is. Um, it's the same sprite. It's the exact same sprite. The flashes. I thought I just thought that was a neat reference. Blake's got so little health compared to the two. I think when he's, I think I've got quite a few uh, mine shells equipped. Should have done that, but I'm gonna take a quick look. At least compared to soul shells. Uh, oh yeah, 130, 135 percent health. That's seven mine shells and only two soul shells. So I might head to base 20. Although 20, um, you know, I might just go and give 24 a go. I think I will actually. Right now. What spells do I have with aura on? Regenerate all. Just regenerate all for you. Um, regenerate all. Step mine, that's good. Um, any healing things that got aura on? No. Regenerate. Oh, regenerate all. Let's put that explode on, and I'll give you that inner demon. Uh, twist. Well, inner demon and twist don't work too well together. So, um. Let's 
take off death in a demon. There's a lot of... But that's not good. Uh, you got heal all. Yeah, I'll give you heal all and... And a demon. Yeah, I'll leave grind on just for the enchantments. Right, let's... Let's give this a go. You have it. Abomination, Berserker, and Orc. Ah, ah. That's it. That's it. Hi. That's it. Oh, this is questionable now. Because, I mean, outside of here, that would have been okay, but. With this curse, I'm not too sure. Can't do a very good job healing. unfortunate combination to come across but it seems to be working out I should hold on for a bit longer I ah, should have used in a demon when I had the chance right okay oh I don't wanna <laughs> I don't wanna leave without the key yeah see the abomination there The abomination there. Uh, like, is it dragging its bot? Like, is it dragging its knee along the floor, or is it just a big foot? Right. I know he's 777 experience. so confident about um, uh, I've got to think about this I'm thinking I might go to I think 21 is 5 as in it's called 5 P-H-I-V-E um, 20 years up still in Opia I think I think with five, I don't have to travel as far, so... I'm gonna go there. Still got a little bit of time left. 
so. Ah, this fight is too hard. Yeah, I mean, you can do this base pretty early. Um, if it works out for you. And if you've got some okay aura spells. Oh, am I in one of those positions where two characters have the same, like, really close to speed? I think I am. Right, let's get this sorted. So... I think that was just how it was, wasn't it? You didn't change those at all. You had poison. And... Rage. Yeah, and I think these. Okay. Um, and you... You had to restore, and this was death. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's it's uh, let's give it a try. I'll have to give episode between six episodes between sixty and seventy minutes. I might actually end up going over this time, but it's not too big of a deal. Um, to be honest, I think, to me, it's a bigger deal that I had that one episode without game audio. It's going to bug me forever now. But you know, it's it's one of those things where you can't let it, like, it, it does get to me, but you shouldn't let it get to you because it's like when you, when you, think like that, you don't get anything done. I think a lot of people probably have that, like that situation. What is my low encounter rate at the moment? 75%. Right. Okay, well let's see if I can do this below the time. Right, okay, so it's four, and then five, and then one. Because I've got to fight poltergeists. I think we find goblins in here. And yes, this is the uh, the infamous, terrible, terrible colour colour tile uh, dungeon. Tile pattern's awful. 
<laughs> Although I like, I mean, I don't like the tile pattern, but I like that there's one that's awful, if you know what I mean. I like that there's one that stands out just for being awful. I suppose the worst I could do it would be like, maybe just straight up black and white. Funny how like the ogre looks so much more powerful, like it's like a bigger version of the orc, but the orc is just so, oh, my finger slips. Like literally, which is like, whoa. Um, yeah, but the orc is actually more powerful. Has like several, like nearly six, well about six times as much health. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? You've got to, um, there's a, a line between, like, theming, um, there's, there's, like, the line of theming, and then there's the line of power, so, it's like they're themed the same, but because one of them you just happen to find later on in the game, it's like, well, you've, that's got to have so much higher stats, just overall. It might not make sense, thematically, that a witch would have more health than an orc, not an orc, an ogre, but it's going to be done. Right, well, uh, I might do this within the time limit. Limit. It's not a limit. It's just uh, the time allocation. Anyway, did I get six keys this 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 uh, session? Six keys in an hour. Well, about an hour. That's amazing. Cause I got. I went pipe that I'm going by numbers, so I went 16, and then I did 22 and then 18, and then I did 19, 24, and now I'm doing 21. Oh. Yeah. Wow. That's brilliant. Right, come on. No more battles, please, no more battles. Let's just get this key. <laughs> well, maybe I spoke a bit too soon. Look what I'm gonna get up against here. Two poltergeists and an abomination. I'm gonna have had a goblin thrown in there. Could have done with that regenerator. Oh, that would have been nice. Restore all. Ah. Ah. It's too early for it. I don't want to use it. Ah. Oh, but I've got to use it. Maybe. Ah. Didn't work. Did not work. Anyway. Um. So yeah. Uh. That. That whole six keys thing didn't. Looks like that didn't pan out, did it? Just kill me. Right, okay. Well, I came close. I came close. Yep, bunch of spells. Right. Um. Three keys. Three keys and that's it. Wow. Okay. Well. Excellent. Still five keys. Excellent progress. Uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.